Time now for Talking Pictures with Tony. If you're looking for something new to watch over the holiday weekend, Tony Toscano has some recommendations for you, including a new season of Yellowstone and the story of a troop of soldiers. Good morning, everyone. As we head into the July 4th weekend, here's a few suggestions of what to watch. Hitting its third season on the Paramount TV network is the hit TV series Yellowstone. It stars Kevin Costner, Cole Hauser, and Kelly Riley. It's called economic evolution. You are sealing yourself into the Alamo. These guys won't take prisoners either. Hey, I want you to give John Dutton a message for me. In the series, the Duttons are a ranching family in Montana who face constant encroaching on their land by developers and unscrupulous businessmen. I caught up to series stars Cole Hauser and Kelly Riley and chatted about season three. Kelly, uh, how has your character evolved over the last couple of seasons? Oh, wow. I mean, we just, we just get to see more of all of these characters. And I think uh, season one is about establishing and setting up. Um, who they are, who we think they are, and the the the, the thing about season three that I that I love and um, was really interested in when I read the scripts and saw where Taylor was taking it was seeing this world sort of quieten down for a minute, you know, when they stop fighting and they're stopped in that sort of high drama, which you know is always going to come back. But he just lets them, uh, you know, he just lets them kind of settle for a second and. For me, what is it like to see Beth when she's not fighting something or someone? But this year is, you know, um, it's not as violent. In fact, you know, this year I, I feel like we have more romance. Like, you know, Kelly had said, the, the, bu the pause button has been stopped a little bit and we're able, not only John with his grandson, but Kelly with, you know, our relationship uh, with Rip and Beth. And then, you know, so I feel there's, there's a, a wonderful moment, especially in the beginning of season three, where um, we're able to breathe a little bit as characters and really kind of look into each other's hearts and, um, and discover some new things about each other. So um, this year is uh, exciting in that regard for us and for me. Is there a season four? Ha ha have the talks been concluded on that? Yes, there is a season four. Um, and that's why we're just, we're just waiting to find out where when and how and 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 when so um yeah but there are scripts and we're you know we're we're getting ready but we're just you know the world is not as it was so we're not sure what that's going to look like but as soon as we as soon as that opens up i know yellowstone will be you know the first uh, one of the first out the gates i think Yellowstone is a superbly filmed, well-acted, and intense adult TV drama that's not to be missed. It gets an A and is rated TVMA. Coming to select theaters and all VOD platforms is the wartime drama The Outpost, based on Jack Tapper's best-selling novel. Every time they take a pot shot at us, they're figuring us out. When the big one comes, all of us dialed in. The story focuses on a small troop of soldiers who come under attack from hundreds of Taliban fighters. The battle left most of their outposts destroyed and eight Americans killed. Strategically, I don't know why anybody would have put them there to begin with. Well, it was a, not the best tactical decision. They, they, this unit was put along with a few other units at the base of these mountains and completely gave away one of the, uh, you know, one of the most obvious and famous rules of military strategy, never give up the high ground. And uh, they, they gave up the high ground completely. And it was inevitable that one day, hundreds and hundreds of Taliban would descend upon them and try to destroy them. The Outpost is an engaging human and intense war story about the brotherhood, duty, and sacrifice of American soldiers. The film honors these heroes and never once flinches or looks away. The Outpost is a great film and one of my favorites of the year. It gets an A and is rated R. For ABC4, I'm film critic Tony Toscano. If you like Tony as much as we do, head to Facebook and like his page, Talking Pictures, or just visit his website, TalkingPictures.tv.